Cops. Paul Kiska attended today's news conference at the county commissioner's office. And Paul joins us live from downtown Cleveland with some pretty emotional reaction from Commissioner Peter Lawson Jones. Right, Paul? Well, that's exactly right this afternoon. Leon, you know, Peter Lawson Jones, a uh, very calm, classy man. He walked into this news conference today. He was uh, obviously upset frustrated and very, very opinionated, uh, being very outspoken and candid. I'm going to read you some of his quotes regarding Frank Russo. He said, Frank Russo should have resigned two years ago. There's no relief here, no closure. This is an unmitigated disaster thanks to a handful of renegades. This is unforgivable. They have affected people's careers. He went on to say, you never really know people if you're not in on the game. As for Jimmy DeMora, again, Peter Lawson Jones outspoken, not holding back, saying, it's time for Jimmy to resign as well. It's long past due. The walls are closing in on Demora, he said. Let's get back to Frank Russo and listen in now to a comment made by Peter Lawson Jones about an hour ago. You never know a person as well as you think. There have been a number of people who've been indicted during this process, this investigation over the last two years. And unless you're in on the game, you never see a certain side that obviously was in existence. If you, it would be impossible for me to work my way through the Byzantine labyrinth that must be the count, the former county auditor's mind to try to ascertain why he did what he did. I assume only only he can respond to that, and he will have ample opportunity to respond to it and to reflect on his conduct the rest of his life. All right, now here's some irony. A week from today, the three Cuyahoga County Commissioners will vote on naming an interim county auditor. Taking place in that vote at this point is Jimmy DeMora. But Peter Lawson Jones made it clear that he and Tim Hagan will be the ones who actually select the next appointment for auditor. The real victims here are perhaps the taxpayers, the homeowners, the residents of Cuyahoga County, who are very upset about how their appraisals have been handled in recent years. They have a lot of questions and concerns. Now, coming up at 1230, my colleague, News Channel 5 reporter Mario Lou will have Peter Lawson Jones' reaction to that part of this breaking news story from the county building. Reporting live downtown, Paul Kiska, News Channel 5. Leon, back to you.